Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Paige, here once again with another video for you guys. But before we get into anything, if you're looking for cheap FIFA 14 and soon to be FIFA 15 Ultimate Team coins, head over to fifacoin.com with the link in the description and use the code PAGE5 for a 5% discount. So anyway, guys, in this video, we're doing another edition of Potential Career Mode Stars. And in this, uh, in this episode, sorry, we are profiling Orlando Aarons. Now, Orlando Aarons scored a quite decent goal against Crystal Palace on the weekend. Just made me want to do this video straight away. Now, he's only 18. He will be turning 19 at the conclusion of this year. He was born in Kingston, Jamaica, which is pretty interesting, but he is eligible to play for England and has recently been called up to the England under national, under national, under 20 national team, sorry, uh, to verse like some random European countries to qualify for some tournament. I think they're versing Romania in one of those games. But anyway, he's only 1.75 meters, so five foot nine, which isn't extremely small, but isn't extremely tall either. He is a left winger, which is uh, definitely his natural position. He looked at home on the wing when he came on for Newcastle on the weekend. In regards to his youth career, he played for Bristol City at, at the latter part of the 2011-2012 season and then transferred over to Newcastle for the 2012-2014 campaigns and uh, has recently been caught up to the senior team. Now, the reason I think he was caught up to the senior team was the fact that he had a really impressive preseason uh, when they traveled to New Zealand. I think he was part of that. But uh, definitely when they first uh, played in the Schalke Cup, he scored a goal and created a goal in the game that they versed Schalke, funnily enough. So he's uh, definitely not afraid of versing the big teams and uh, definitely has a big future ahead of him. Now, he has played three games in total, technically. He did play a League Cup game, but in regards to uh, the actual just League games, he's played two games and scored one goal with the only total... Uh, cumulative time of 45 minutes. So he played about, uh, roughly half an hour for Newcastle against Crystal Palace and scored a goal. And then he played about 15 minutes against New, uh, against uh, Man City, might I say. So in regards to minutes per goal, he's going quite well, I must say. So anyway, guys, that's the end of this video. If you could leave a like, it would be very much appreciated. What do I think of Rolando Irons? Irons, might I say, sorry. I think he's going to be quite high potential in regards to what his starting rating will be. He'll have a lot of growth. I think he might only be like a 62 to 64 overall at the beginning of FIFA 15 and um, I definitely think his potential could be in like the 84s but I think if EA are a bit dodgy and a bit might be a bit late to give him a high potential but because he only just um, stood out then sorry I've just knocked my mic but I think he might have a potential of 79 if EA are a bit dodgy with it but if EA are going to give his full potential I think they might give him an 84 or 85 potential rating. So thanks for watching guys, as I said before, if you leave a like, it would be very much appreciated. Leave any comments as well, and if you're new here, make sure to subscribe. Make sure to follow me on Twitter, link will be in the description below. And I'll catch you in the next video guys. Check out any of my previous videos. Goodbye.